So guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel. Today I have another custom for uh, you guys, so let's get into this. Hopefully you enjoy it. If you're new, like and subscribe. So, on the bed today we have uh, this box. Please ignore Sokoni. No coffee right there. Um, yeah, I just had to keep it in a box. So, I'm going to do it like this. Hopefully you haven't got too much of a glimpse yet. Because I'm going to be fully going through this. Uh, and what I've done with this. So please stick around just for a quick review on this one. So before I begin, this is a very special pair because it was actually before it was uh, like in the back of the cupboard. It was completely dirty and broken up, used, and it was too small for most most of our family members. Uh, used to be my brothers, uh, but I decided to see what I could do with it, cleaned it up, whatever. Tried uh, use some methods I found on YouTube, which was very helpful, and then I've got. Uh, to uh, these, so first glance there. Right, so the first thing we have here is the colour schemes. Obviously on here we've got a light blue, uh, somewhat matching this blue, uh, just quickly, and then the blue logo here. This is a Clark shoe. I know, it's, you know, but hey. Um, yeah, I'm taking these old shoes. I'm, you know, they're not like Nike or they're not new or anything, so bear that in mind. So we've got the pink here, the pink here, and then uh, the same pink logo there. So nextly, um, the fabric applicants. Um, oh, how am I going to hold this? On the toe here, um, oh, I've got a fabric that I found on quite the deal at a local fabric store. Um, I use for a lot of things but I thought this would be quite cool to so I've done multiple layers on this particular part you can see it on the velcro strap here which I've I didn't wish it was there but I've taken it into the into the shoe and I've made it made it something so I've got there there and you know it's going to be on the other side so um after that I'm going to talk about the military camo of this. So this started to follow a slight war theme after I started doing this. So I continued with that, as you'll see. Um, once we get a bit further in, we have camo all around here. Uh, that was for my first camo. And then I used just the general camo colours all around the back here. Hey guys, what is up? Uh, yeah, I went into a different... Well, the next day to uh, finish filming this, uh, got a lot on, couldn't quite finish it. So, gonna continue the review from where we were, and please stick around. I'm gonna do a little time lapse or something just uh, at the end, and I've got another shoe on the way that I'm gonna show you. So, uh, without further ado, let's go back into the shoes. So, the first thing we're gonna go back into is. Um, the back of the shoes. So continuing the war theme uh, that I met, I think I mentioned earlier, we have uh, this faded person comes in uh, holding, well, what is a gun? So uh, with a firing uh, blow there on the right. Um, and then, if you're walking behind, you can also see this poppy, obviously symbolising war and peace and all that. So, that's uh, what I've drawn on the back. I thought that was quite cool, so comment if you like that as well. Um, here you might have noticed a little leather applicant here and here, different types of leather, just to jazz it up. One's down, one's up, jazz it Alright, so I think I mentioned some of the colour schemes but not sure if I went in on the sides here because you might not have noticed you might not have um, we have a cartoony design I noticed this was becoming quite popular like doodling on your air forces or whatever make them look like a cartoon this was part of the method so in different colours on all the sides there is a cartoony um, look going in the cherry colour as well and the lime colour 
cherry, lime, sky, uh, don't know what to call this one, comment down below again <laughs> what you want to call that one. Coming up to the end for these ones, um, I took inspiration off of the Horizon shoes uh, and that kind of galaxy look. If you haven't seen that video, go and check it out. Um, so I took inspiration in that I used rubbing alcohol to merge. You can't see here, but that's um, on the sides right there and all around there. But you can see it slightly better if you take a look on the inside um, that's all in there and stuff so again all there and in the tongue so yeah that's these merged colors a bit like a sky a dark night sky whatever uh, last I think it's last now um, quotes quotes there's always quotes I love to put quotes in my shoes signature so <laughs> Uh, here, quote is, it all starts with a shoe. I love this quote, uh, again, one that I made up, they all are really, so, uh, I like that because it's kind of symbolises that your outfit starts with a shoe, which, for me, I don't know, what do you guys, uh, base your outfit off of, but that's kind of what it goes from. Uh, and then this one, uh, just says, gloriously unique, so, those are the quotes, gloriously unique, it's unique, I think, I think we can both agree this. She's unique. So next, we're on to our next pair. Um, yeah, these are some old vans that I had. I don't know why. I just want to show you guys. Uh, as a side part to those, those were definitely the main ones. But these are something I just like to doodle on. Maybe show you guys. So, um, here... They are, at first glance, they're the old school highs in this suede green. The suede is rubbed off those, literally. But I love vans. Uh, these ones have served me for a while, so, yeah, loyalty. Um, but I've swapped out the laces from white to um, red and blue, yeah. Um, and then on the inside, matching the red and blue somewhat, I have this kind of, like, grainy red with, like, a black outline there and also you notice I have the little off-white tag experimenting all right it's no copy right there um so yeah you look in on that and then on this shoe I prefer a bit it's like an electricity blue so I continued that lightning electricity with these little you can see black I've left white bits out with the white outline there so um, if you've enjoyed this video, we're done now, uh, leave a like, uh, whatever, subscribe, please, that'd be so cool, uh, I'd love to be able to hit 10, 20, and slowly make our way up, that'd be so amazing, I'd be over the moon if just you, you count, so please subscribe if you're watching this, um, till next time, with another custom, I'm sure I will, um, but no, yeah.